Cincinnati just a half game ahead of the Houston Astros in second place in the AL West. Seattle comes in at 13 and 11. The Astros at 12 and 11. Zach delivers a strike. And we're underway. Baker looking on just one win shy of catching Casey Stengel. And Zach Greinke picks up a strikeout of the first batter he faces tonight as Haggerty goes down swinging. Good change up by Zach Greinke. We're going to see it on our matches from Supermo. The best ERA against any team in the American League. Seeger drives one deep to right center field towards the bullpen and that will one hop up and over the pen. So Seeger who was the only Mariner hitter to have a hit last night doubles here with two outs in the first inning. Swing and a miss and a grunt with the strikeout. Kyle Lewis kind of looks out at Zach Greinke after that strikeout saying what was that. Shut out first for Zach. Altuve first pitch swinging sends one deep to left field back goes Trammell he's got a play that was pulled a little bit could have been a quick start for the Astros instead it's just a long out as Altuve sends one to the track and left. Yeah if he just pulled more in Boston on the road. He gets Michael Brantley swinging popping away from the catcher Torrens. He'll make the throw to first in time. First strike out of the night for Dunn. Don't miss a minute of Astros baseball. Five when he threw six shutout innings against Seattle. Swing and a foul tip caught by Maldonado. Frankie picks up strikeout number three, two away in the second. Time now to look at our Chevy Stroll Paul. In this series, the top in the American League. Four pitch walk. Kyle Tucker, a leadoff base runner here in the second inning. Tucker on the go, pitches a ball, head first slide by Kyle Tucker, he is safe. Second steal of the year for Tucker going on the first pitch against Justin Dunn. Hit hard to left field, base hit, Tucker's going to be waved around. Taylor Trammell's throw coming home, Tucker's safe. McCormick head first slide, he's safe. Astros lead 1-0 on the RBI by Chaz McCormick. Two out lightning from Chaz. Up the middle, that's going to be a base hit. McCormick will score easily. Miles Straw, a two strike, two out RBI. Astros now lead two to nothing. His career against the Mariners, and those are. As good as it gets, although Torrens drives one deep to left field. Chaz McCormick looking up, and this ball's gone. Luis Torrens snaps it 0 for 21 on the first pitch of the third inning with his first home run of the year. And the Mariners cut the lead in half. It's 2 to 1. Didn't see that coming. Probably wanted that fastball down and away, and it was up out over the plate. Torrens didn't miss him, miss it. Just his second major league home run. That 16.52 is up for him. Man, another one. Back to back. Woo. That changeup came down and in on the lefty. It's crazy how he can miss with one and come back and throw one better. Yeah, that had a different rotation on a two TK. And Zach is the most unique pitcher in baseball. So, oh, there you go. I think I think that was a fastball. 89. Yeah, maybe. Or in on him a little bit. Yeah, that was a tracer. Series, but they've done damage within the teams in their division. That's amazing. Right? Yeah, that's real. <laughs> That doesn't make much sense. 12 and 6 against the AL West and then 0 and 5 against everybody else in this upright and then it was kind of coming back to the plate. Back to back walks with two outs. That is a rarity for Zach Greinke. Especially at this part of the lineup. Patient. There's a ball down the left field line for a fair ball. That'll drive in at least one. Trammell coming around third. 
Correa's got a shot to get him. Carlos throw. Safe at home plate. Maldonado can't hold on. Aldi may have been spiked on that play. Mariners score two on that double by Torrens. It's now a three to two game. Maldonado being looked at at home plate. 3-0 pitch and a green light. That ball's rocketed into right field towards the corner. Torrens will score. J.P. Crawford in the second base with a double. Now it's a 4-2 Mariners lead. All this coming with two outs and nobody on base. Two games at 6.17. Swing and a miss. He gets Haggerty for the third time. But that is a frustrating inning for Zach Greinke as he gives up three. In an inning where he had two outs and nobody on before a couple of walks for two Mariners. Say Kikuchi will be the starter tomorrow. Another lefty. And Tucker goes down swinging on the slider on the outside corner. Strikeout number two for Dunn. Both times he's gotten left hand hitters Brantley and Tucker. Ball's hit hard to left field, and this ball is gone. Line drive home run by Kyle Lewis. Hits a 2 2 pitch out into the Crawford boxes, his second home run of the series. And the Mariners now lead this game 5 to 2. That was a laser beam. 108.3 off the bat. Mm. 377 foot line drive slider that just backed up and stayed out over the plate. Ooh. He is strong. We've seen power to all fields off the bat of Kyle Lewis. Starting to get that swing back after he came in here with what looked like some numbers that were struggling a little bit. Well, punch shot to center coming on Lewis, and he'll have to play it on a hop. Miles Straw, two for two tonight. A couple of hits to center field. The Astros for now. Part of his tradition. There goes Straw. Pitches away. Maldonado draws a walk. Straw in head first, but doesn't matter. That is ball four to Maldonado, and the Astros will bring the tying run to the plate here with one out in the fifth. All of a sudden, the Astros here against Chicago. On the ground, Brantley rounds one towards Evan White, and that'll do it for the Astros in the fifth. Two men left on base. We are through five, Seattle five, and Houston two. Swing and a miss. Got him with the breaking ball. That's the first strikeout for Brandon Belak, and two away in the sixth inning. Two and two the count. Swing and a miss. Got him with that slider. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Belak as he gets a 1-2-3 inning here in the sixth inning. Alex Bregman, Kyle. Yuli into right center field towards the bullpen. Well hit. Going back, Marmalejos. It's off the wall. Gurriel into second base with a two-out double. Six-game hitting streak for Yuli Gurriel. As he sends the ball off the wall in right center. On the ground, past the diving shortstop, Crawford in the left field. That'll be an RBI base hit for Carlos Correa. Two out, single for the Astros. All their runs coming with two outs tonight. It's now five to three. Another good at bat by an Astro fighting through it. Who has a base hit and an RBI? He goes down swinging for the final out of the inning. But the Astros add one. They're now down by a pair. It's 5-3 Mariners after six. That ball hit hard into right field. Going to be a one-out base hit for Haggerty. Hit number six for the Mariners. Ballpark starter Justin Dunn. Oh, look out. Middleton on a 1-0 pitch comes up and in and gets straw. Hits him with a pitch and that'll bring the tying run to the plate. That might be a double. Straw take off the He's off and racing. Pitch is down and away. Straw now five for six and steals. No throw. He gets into scoring position here with nobody out. 
Swing and a miss. Got him to swing at a slider that was in on him. Lewis afraid that was going to break over the plate and took a hack and missed it. Smith has his first strikeout. Tried to hold up. He goes around. Could have been a called strike anyhow. So Joe gets it one way or the other. That's two outs. White goes down swinging. Line drive into right field. That'll be down for a hit. A two out single for Marmalejos. Up to right field. And Moore is picked off. As a pitch runner, he is picked off. A wide throw and a nice play by Carlos Correa, <laughs> who tags him all the way almost back to first base for the final out of the inning. Joe Smith picking off Dylan Moore. And a nice play by Correa to get the out. Say Kikuchi will face Luis Garcia for the Astros. On the ground, Seeger can't get there. Base hit Kyle Tucker. Just enough in the right spot to get into center field. Tucker, a one out base runner here in the eighth, hit number six for the Astros. Sharply hit. There's another multi hit game for Yuli, number 10 on the year. Most of the major leagues, Yuli continues to rake. Ground ball right side. White has it. He'll make the play. No, he throws it away. Coming in to score, Tucker. It's a one-run game. The gold glover, Evan White, throws it away. And the Astros in business down one. There's a ball into left center field. Yuli is headed to third. He'll be waved around. Here comes the throw. Cut off. We're tied at five. Clutch at bat for Litmus Diaz. Outside ball four. The bases are loaded. Go ahead run comes to third base and coming out of the dugout to pinch hit for Martin Maldonado is the left hand hitting catcher Jason Castro. Outside ball four. Astros take the lead on the bases loaded walk to Jason Castro to force it a run. In the right field, Haggerty just moved out to right field. Diaz is tagging and coming home. The throw will not be in time. Seven to five game, Altuve a sacrifice fly. Everybody moves up a base. Ground ball right side, playable, Dylan Moore there. He will make the throw for the final out. But the Astros put up four big runs in the bottom half of the eighth inning. Ryan Stanek will be on to try and close out this 7-5 lead. American League. Call third strike, 99. Trammell couldn't pull the trigger. And he's down looking for the first out of the ninth. Ground ball, right side. Jose Altuve is there. Ball game over. Big comeback for the Astros with four in the bottom half of the eighth inning. And Ryan Stanek picks up his second Major League save, his first in the American League. The Astros win 7-5. And Blummer, that is quite a win tonight.